están? Soy Karina. Voy a hablar todo en español en este video. No te creas. I don't think I can do a whole three of me in Spanish. But I was just listening to Bad Bunny's album, Un Verano Sin Ti. I can't. I can't stop. It hyped me up this morning. And I'm just like, let's go. It's going to be a bomb ass thrifting day. After going to that quality thrift, I was like, girl, it's been a long time since you've gone. So I am here this morning at Quality Thrift. And honestly, no like really like inspiration that I have. Maybe just like look at my Pinterest for reference. But yeah, nothing really that like I can think of right now. And I think I kind of want to go with that mindset because I feel like I can maybe be more open to things, uh, but still obviously go with a critical mindset. I, obviously, I just don't want to get things I feel like are unnecessary. So yeah, it's lo que estamos haciendo hoy. Y tú sabes, like you know, sometimes, you know, filming these thrift with me's, it can be hard because I feel like sometimes I want to be like super chatty in the thrift with me's, but like I'm a very introverted person. And so like, I I get like nervous when people are like, what is she doing with her camera? Like, what, what's up girl? All right, y'all, enough blabbing for me and I'll catch you inside. looking like there was just so much stuff and I just really wanted to check it out so I already checked the tops and the nightgown dresses so I see some wedding dresses and I kind of wanted to see it with y'all so yeah that's I'm letting you know it's just this one short I just I don't know why I feel so anxious filming right now it's so strange because I've done this one often so I don't know I wanted to thrift like a wedding dress but a lot of them are small and like I wouldn't even know how to like alter it to make it bigger. Look at the puff sleeves. The bones. Oh my god. Sometimes I wonder the people who donated these dresses, are they like still with their people, you know? Now. Since we're close to the dresses, I'm gonna check them out right here. This is so stunning, giving me Princess Diana. Oh my god, this is gorgeous. Like, look at this. I love the style of this. Like, it's definitely what I've been looking for on my Pinterest. It has a tie up back. Okay. And it's only $3.93. Okay. She's coming with me. Okay. I don't know what's going on, but look at this. All right. This one's definitely coming home with me. Oh my God. I wish this was in my size because it's like that beautiful Italian style suit dress. Like,
my friend cycles. I wonder if he, if I get him this, he'll wear it. I just found some hookah salmon like hiking boots. I saw these online. They're crazy expensive. Checking the shoes as well because I've been looking for some shoes, especially some like ballet-ish type of shoes. Okay, let's check the skirts. I'm kind of looking for like a cargo skirt like this one. That looks nice. That would be fine. Or a specific one I'm looking for is like a white tiered one. That one's not that bad. There's Chico's. Maybe it'll fit. It's so fun, actually. Shorts are something that I always have trouble thrifting, so like a lot of the times I don't even bother. But what if you can find some shorts that are, you know, cargo style? Like these, these are fun. These are nice. They're size 16, but they look like rough denim, so I don't think they'll fit. So yeah, I'm just checking in this like long sleeve section to see if I find anything interesting. Um, not really. Oh, that's a nice, I love it. I'm just not a peplum girl. So I was watching the show called The Durrells and cause I love Josh O'Connor. So anything he's in, I'm watching. And he constantly wears a striped shirt like this all the time. And it, part of me is like interested in this because of that so yeah and it's can look at how big my cart is already y'all it's filled like why why oh my god ballet flats or heels doesn't say the size though they look too small for me oh my god my hair is like not it today but i'm going through everything now because i think i'm pretty much done and yeah so i think i'm gonna show you some of the things not everything because that's the whole point of a haul this cargo skirt really nice but not my size this one i thought it was so cute i love the mesh and the ribbon but just not my size this one because it's a harley davidson like freaking cool top but like nine dollars I love the little flare, but I think I would have liked it more if it was white, you know? I love the little keyhole detail, but I don't think like it's necessary in my closet, you know? This little shrug, and I'm going to try it on, because I don't know, I'm like conflicted on this one. I really like this, the structure of it. It's just like, right now, I don't know, I think I might leave this one. These dresses are so cute, I just want to try them on to see before so maybe that one just depends on the fit I think this one's gonna be too small so I'll leave this one but yeah that's a couple I gotta go so I'll see you when I get back home I really want some boba so I'm thinking of getting some boba um, or or there's this other thrift store I wanted to go to but honestly, I think I'm good. I ended up spending $27. It wasn't a sale day, which is kind of bummed about that because usually you can find good things. For $27, bucks, I was hoping to spend under $20, but it's all good. So. Okay, so, just got my boba, like I said, I was going to. And I got this sea salt um, iced coffee one. I've always had trouble finding boba that's vegan. They say it's non-dairy. But I'm not sure, but let's mix this. I got a coffee one because, you know, homegirl needs it. And I thought we'd, like, try it together. Why not? And I always ask my stuff half sweet because boba's already sweet, you know? Mm, definitely tastes watered, watered coffee. Mm. For six bucks. Mm. Yeah, it's not good. It was definitely watered coffee. Mm -mm. So, let's go home and 
let's get to the haul what's up it's time for the thrift haul so, so it's actually the same day i just quickly added a little bit of like some jewelry and some new lipsticks i kind of wanted to go it through everything already because because i honestly need to do laundry and i thought this is a perfect time to put all this stuff in there and yeah so i was like let's just get through the haul and show you everything that i ended up getting i got a total of like seven items which i'm telling you y'all i feel like lately i haven't been really like finding a lot of clothes if you've been seeing like my last thrift hauls so i was kind of surprised that like homegirl came through you know thrifting today it was a vibe so but you know what wasn't a vibe this freaking boba that i ended up getting like uh-uh never again i even tried to open it so i can't like my own like whipped cream and stuff no i can never say no to boba because i like i like balls in my mouth let's get into it first off i'm just gonna start with an accessory because it was literally at the top of the bag but i found this bag y'all i don't think i showed you it's like a simple black crossbody bag i've been really into like the bags with the buckle detail lately and i love when you have an adjustable strap i feel like i used to be a crossbody girl back in the day i feel like i used to wear crossbody bags all the time and i'm like what happened and i'm bringing it back it was only three dollars and 93 cents so yeah i just thought it'd be a cute little purse to have all right so now let's get into the clothes because i got a couple items y'all first piece here which automatically drew me because y'all know that i've been on the search for the perfect just like white dress or those are just a nice staple in anyone's closet i feel like in the summer i'm constantly in dresses and i've been searching for literally this kind for a while this bodycon style like dress it has the puff sleeves and you know a little self tie moment in the front and it's all in this like eyelet detail it's in a really nice like comfortable stretchy material which i love and then there's a little ruffle at the end and this just reminds me of like you know those bardo like style dresses that i feel like were really popular in like 2019 era always still really cute and gorgeous in the summer very easy piece to wear you can dress it up you can dress it down by the brand called j for justify and this one was three dollars and 93 uh, i saw this and i just pictured a layering moment like with something under like a top or even this beautiful bodysuit that i'm wearing right now and whole lace like cami or i want to say it could be a dress but it's i still feel like it's too short for a dress but it's just so beautiful like i mentioned i feel like this pairing it with a cute little black bralette underneath some high-waisted denim and a cute little like kitten heel with your hair slicked back mm. and i also think you can wear this too with like maybe like a black mini skirt underneath this is by the brand called Vic oh it's victoria's secret i didn't know that and it's an extra large this one was six dollars and 96 cents i think this was the most expensive item but she a cutie yo i don't know if you're gonna be surprised by this item but i yeah i just had to get this one i was trying it on there was a lady who saw me try it on she's like that's cute that's perfect you definitely have to get it and i was like i don't need that much convincing you know so it is this white ruffly like dress it's off the shoulder very dainty and it has polka dots so they're hard to tell but there is some polka dot detail in there and y'all know i've been a sucker so then polka dots and i just think this off the shoulder very cute and stunning with i don't know i just love it and i love the material and it's a mini and i thought this with my red ballet flats that's all i need baby and yeah it was super affordable as well it was only three dollars and 93 cents and it is by the brand called mabel so yeah just had to get this baby loved it it's just really cute this next piece i've been really like wanting to find this style but like sometimes i was very like nervous of trying this kind of pattern because i thought i would look like a mime but i definitely just have to get over that i got this like long sleeve striped top and i've always wanted one of these because i feel like i've seen people style it really beautiful especially i feel like this kind of style is like a very capsule wardrobe like silhouette or print it was inspired by the show that i was watching on prime and it is called the durells i believe i'm obsessed with josh o'connor like and he's in that show and he wears a striped 
long sleeve like this and he just looks so good yeah really happy about it i think this is gonna pair so nicely with some trousers or even like like a black mini skirt and like a blazer over it and like yeah and this one was only a dollar 91 so i was just like okay let's try it out for two dollars i think it's pretty much worth it so this piece yeah y'all i just had to get it it is this hardly tea y'all i couldn't leave it behind i feel like it's just really beautiful and i love the little bedazzled side i remember when those lace-up tops were so big i think it was like what like 2017 i remember seeing them everywhere got this one it is in a size large and this one was nine dollars <laughs> it hurt a little bit but i'm like for a harley tee i guess it's not that bad right last piece which when i saw this i was like oh my god screaming eternally definitely a pinterest item that i've seen on my boards and i just had to get it this gorgeous white dress it's a mini dress and i just love the style of it it's so beautiful it's you know like a rouging in the front and it has this nice like puff sleeve and then a self tie in the back so it's very adjustable which i like this one doesn't have a brand it like they took off the tag so i don't even know what size it is either this was also only three dollars and 93 cents so i was like it's just too good to leave it this is honestly my favorite dress that I thrifted, but I definitely thrifted a lot of dresses, which is so interesting because I feel like every time I go there, I hardly have any good luck thrifting dresses. And for some reason that day it was like, we giving you the dresses, honey. And I was like, oh damn. Y'all enjoy when I do the talk throughs with the outfits. So that's what we're doing. I did get a haircut. If you notice that, that is why. I'm, like, I'm gonna show you how I style this dress. And honestly, I kind of like it. So let me show you real quick. And sorry, you're pretty low, but yeah. Here is this dress. The way it fits, I really love how it looks here. And I decided to pair it with this beautiful vintage Dior like cardigan. I don't know, it was just giving me like preppy. I don't know, I just felt that a little bit. And I love how the cardigan ends where the little like ruffle starts and actually this morning i've been on poshmark just like liking so many things and I, and I came across these like pink ballet flats that have a ribbon on them and i'm thinking of purchasing those because i feel like it would have gone so perfect with this whole outfit and also a little nervous on trying on white because i just started my period so if i'm not as preppy that's another reason why very cute i have like a plethora of white dresses now which is honestly what i've been searching for um, and i just noticed that you can probably see my underwear i'm wearing red underwear today i uh, forgot so sorry about that I'm obsessed with this dress i just love the cut and look at the back self tie on the back yeah even with this like haircut i love the way my hair just ends like up here and i paired it with of course my roman tenenza sling back heels yeah, love it guess what it is another white dress i wanted to add another little item to this and that was this like corset waist corset i personally wish i had like those knee like high like demonia style shoes i think they're like the the shaker boots i think that's what they're called they would look so cute with this outfit and i was looking at many high boots and i just honestly feel like none of them did it justice to like what i was trying to envision so i basically didn't pair it with some shoes just imagine those i feel like that would have looked so sick what do you think i am so obsessed with this dress for four dollars yes honey give it to me all right y'all so let me show you this one i kind of got lazy putting my shoes on so i'm just showing you the top portion okay I oh my god i love the way this layered so this is that lace like dress or cami i've been obsessed with anything kind of mesh and lacy i don't know what it is but it's giving me very like crabbis i am impressed i love when i have visions of what i can do with an item go home i know what i'm gonna pair it with and it's just like like bread and butter it was like yes baby those go so fine together and i was just talking without the microphone on here is the stripe top i'm loving this whole classic silhouette and print i just had to pair it with a classic karina outfit which is a blazer with a black mini skirt this is like my go-to style when i just don't know what to wear or don't know how to pair an item i feel like it works 
all the time and i love this top now i feel like me and josh o'connor are like vibing together i'm not gonna lie though i do have them on my home screen on my iphone so that's how you know she she likes them a lot i still think it looks cute like this as well which is kind of how i'm gonna wear it for the rest of the day because it's too hot with the blazer and i paired this with some loafers because honestly these are have been my go-to a lot lately let me know how you like it down below can't believe i almost forgot to show you the harley tee and i was like how am i gonna style it girl just go with your go-to formula which was what i was wearing previously that's literally how i'm styling it it's just with a black mini skirt cute and the loafers all black outfit which is always a go-to for me and i think it looks like sorry that the lack of styling kind of went through the i feel like we started off good and then it was just like and i blame that with just like feeling kind of fatigue today so sorry about that what do you think let me know y'all i'm so excited for this summer i feel like there's gonna be so many amazing things and i just really want to get dressed and be out <laughs> need some homies for sure that's it y'all thank you so much for watching this video it truly means the world to me and i hope you enjoyed it i had fun thrifting today and i cannot wait to wear all these items and style it for y'all so let me know what kind of styling video you want to see i definitely want to do one next that was everything for today's video thank you so much for the love and support and if you're new to the channel please don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below and if you want to follow me you can check my instagram and tiktok it's living as karina and don't forget to like and share it helps a homegirl out with the algorithm. That is all for me, loves. Thank you so much, and I'll see you soon. Bye.